There's no doubting what you've achieved on a technical level. These are clearly state-of-the-art. There are just certain design choices that were made for these robots that we don't fully understand. We were hoping that you could shed some light on those. She can dance. She can sing. She's equipped with a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons right at her fingertips. She can take song requests. She can even dispense ice cream. With all due respect, those aren't the design choices we were curious about, Mr. Afton. Mr. Afton? Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's. Now, we're in a sister location, which means that we're not in a Freddy Fazbear's pizzeria. And that introduction was interesting because we just got introduced to two new characters we've never heard from before. Or at least that's what I'm assuming because that definitely wasn't Phone Guy. And the other guy, Mr. Afton, seems to be the designer of at least these animatronics. Now, in my mind, I'm wondering if this guy designed all the animatronics, but I'm not 100% sure about that because these guys are definitely, definitely, from a fundamental standpoint, different than the previous animatronics. So, Honestly, who knows? We don't know anything at this point, so I'm gonna stop theorizing. I'm gonna stop assuming anything about this game because I don't know a damn thing. And we're gonna get right into the meat of the story right now. So, uh, I want to thank Scott for uh, giving me early access Dad, to the- Dad, why won't you let me play with her? Did you hear words Welcome there? Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Hi! Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad and screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we welcome you. I will be your personal guide to help you get started. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Please enter your name Jesus. as seen above the keypad. Oh, okay. This cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Wait, is my name Mike? Do I have to enter that name? I mean, okay, wait a minute. Mike as in Mike Schmidt? Because Mike Schmidt was the first guy from the first Five Nights at Freddy's, and I'm not 100% sure that was that. I don't know if I can hit this. Hit it! I think I got it. M A. No, no. Where's R? I can't read this. Ha! Ah, uh, ha! Ah, shit. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. No. I see what you were trying to type, and I will autocorrect it for you. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. <laughs> I, I'm, not, I'm not Benedict Cumberbatch. I'm me. I'm Markiplier. Thanks for entering my name correct. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is going on here? Oh, that's so weird. Oh, what is this? Where am I? Hello? Is someone gonna let me out of here? Am I actually going? How? Oh! oh, this is cool. Oh, this is really cool. Now, Scott, when he when he gave me the key, he said that this game was going to be very. You can now open the elevator using that bright red and obvious button. Oh! Let's get to work. Okay. All right then. Ha boy! Oh boy. Why is it all danger? Why is it danger? Why Why are we going in the danger? I don't want to crawl down there. Okay, let's crawl down there. Allow me to fill this somewhat frightening silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success, and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day, and it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually a crawl space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. Uh. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's turn on the light and see if Ballora is on stage. Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. I'm trying, man. Oh, where's Ballora? Uh -oh. It looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. <laughs> Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe that will put the spring back in her step. What? Why am I gonna make them mad? Why do I want dancing? 
fancy pants to be mad at me! Oh, jeez. Let's check the light again. I don't wanna. Why are you making me do this? Oh, it's broken. Oh, oh! Now Excellent. she's dancing. Ballora is feeling like her old self again and will be ready to perform again tomorrow. Oh. Now view the window to your right. Oh, okay. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to play and share. Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Uh, again, I don't know if I want to. If I know anything about angering any animatronic, it's that Foxy is a big old bag of dicks and hates me. <laughs> oh, jeez. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's motivate Funtime oh. Foxy with a controlled shock. Ah, nothing like a good bit of electro motivation to get the day started. Haboski! Oh, jeez. <laughs> Maybe it's like Futurama and they really like this stuff. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Let's try another controlled shock. How about we don't? How about we don't? How about we give them a nice cupcake and everyone goes along with their day? <laughs> oh, good! Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Hell yeah! Great job! In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the Circus Gallery control module. I don't want to! Why are you making me crawl? It was, it was everyone else is supposed to crawl through the vents to kill me! And they're gonna do that. I have a funny feeling. Oh, uh, why can I look around here? Oh, uh, why do I need to crawl faster? Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. Ah! Is that me? Or is that something else? If that's something else. I'm fucked. If that's me! Uh, okay. On the other side of the glass oh, is God. Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. Maybe we don't. Maybe I should quit this horrible job. I mean, I'm literally being talked to by an artificial intelligence. What era is this in? It's like steampunk or electropunk technology here. Oink. Oh, she's not there. Looks like a few of the lights are out, but oh. we can fix that later. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a controlled shock. Ah! Ah! Something tells me angering Baby might be the worst decision. Not yet! Let's try another controlled shock. L let's do that thing! Oh, there's a lot- There's a lot of beepers and boopers over here! I'm gonna beep and bonk my way to beep down! I can't click on your nose! You're, you look like you dead balloon boy over there. That is definitely 100% balloon boy over there. Head Whiskey. Nice! Okay. Uh-oh. Let's try another controlled shot. Why, why can't you do this? Why does it have to be a physical button? That way you can place the blame on me. Uh-oh. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. Well, I... That concludes your duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed, otherwise you might not come back. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Why well, didn't see baby? I don't see her! Where is she? Oh, maybe, maybe I'm just gonna, maybe I'm gonna forget about this and go back. All right, goodbye. Oh man, this is so weird. <laughs> All right. Let's skedaddle on out of here, so I- ah! trigger. Circus gallery vent. Ah! Hey! <laughs> ah! What the fuck was that? Oh boy! Enjoy some time at home! Well, <laughs> my nightmares will consume my dreams. Another day, another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? All of that and more happening now. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. <laughs> You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. Upright or upside down? 
What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be your father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you deadbeat. Will Vlad and his distressed mistress find common ground? Tune in next time. What well, I am... I am so unbelievably, utterly confused right now. But then again, this is what... This is what Scott said. This Daddy, game was gonna... You let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? I don't know. Maybe your daddy doesn't want you Welcome to go near- Welcome back for another night of intellectual stimulation, Hi. pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. <laughs> We're committed to creating a unique and fulfilling work experience. Uh -huh. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Oh. Using the keypad below, please select a new companion voice. What? For male, press 1. For female, press 2. For <laughs> text only, press 3. For other options, press four. There's no numbers! I can't put any numbers in here! How in the fuck do you expire? Right, fine, boop. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, oh, and oh, I will auto-correct it for you. Oh, cool. Thank you for choosing Angsty Teen. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Am I going to get an Angsty Teen here? Are you going to turn into an Angsty Teen, bruh? You gonna give me some angst? You gonna be my my online Darkiplier persona? Oh. Yeah. Should I should I be worried about that? I can't remember if that happened last time I was here. Oh jeez. Oh man, it's so weird. I can see the reflection of everything behind me. Oh boy, night two! We're already plowing through this game! I can't wait to see how we get through this. Okay, Habuski. Oh. The elevator stopped. You know the routine. <laughs> get out now or whatever. <laughs> or stay here if you want. Really? Can I stay here? What'll happen if I stay here? Hello? Hello, hello? Oh, hi! Okay, all right. Goodbye. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, boy. So, funny story. A dead body was found in this vent once. Okay, so not that funny, but it's a story. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a great story. Well, not a great story, but yep, yeah, it's a story, all right. Was it my dead body? Are you reporting from the future because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die here? Okay, let's start with your nightly chores. Ugh. You should check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage, but whatever. <laughs> whatever. Okay. Oh, hi. Huh. I guess Ballora has better things to do. Let's zap her. Yeah. That should be fun. Yeah, that will be fun. Ballora. Oh, fuck. Okay. okay. I'm still not okay with those things in the... In the distance, blinking rapidly, I have no idea what those are. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Make sure he's ready for showtime tomorrow. Wait, was that like a voice thing? Well, we didn't even check on Ballora! Why is Foxy in the shadows? Great. 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 Uh, I don't like that! There seems to have been a problem with the voice synthesizer. Default settings have been restored. Please proceed through the vent ahead of you to Circus Baby's auditorium. Uh, but I didn't give Foxy a shock! Also, I just noticed there's a vent down by Foxy and a vent down by Ballora. When the hell are you gonna make me go in those places? Because that's the one, that's, I don't want to do that. I would rather do anything but that. Oh, jeez. Yeah, oh, God. I'm fine. I'm a brave boy. I'm a brave- Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. Okay, so there's always- Oh! So this is the circus gallery vent, then you got the foxy vent, then you got the Ballora vent. Circus Baby had a busy day today. Let's check the light and make sure she's in proper working order. Okay. Oh, still don't see her. Oh, Circus Baby, we aren't here to play hide and seek. Let's encourage Baby to come out of hiding with a controlled shock. Hey, Baby! Baby! Baby, come out! Baby, come back! Uh-oh. 
Let's try another controlled shock. Wait, wait, bear, it didn't work. Baby, it didn't work on baby. Oh boy. Hey, baby. There seems to be a power malfunction that is affecting our ability to properly motivate baby. Uh huh. Please stand by while I reboot the system. I don't want to stand by. I will be offline momentarily during this process. Oh! Various other systems may be offline as well, don't leave such me. as security doors, vent locks, and oxygen. Commencing system restart. How about no? Motion trigger, entryway vent. Uh oh. Oh. Funtime Auditorium Maintenance Vent Opened. Ballora Gallery Maintenance Vent Opened. I don't recognize you. You are new. I remember this scenario, however. It's a strange thing to want to do, to come here. I'm curious what events would lead a person to want to spend their nights in a place like this. Willingly. Maybe curiosity? Maybe ignorance? There is a space under the desk. Someone before you crafted it into a hiding place, and it worked for him. I recommend that you hurry, though. You will be safe there. Oh. Just try not to make eye contact. It will be over soon. They will lose interest. Oh! Who are we talking about? Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm under the desk. What does that mean? Grab here. What is it? Oh. Uh, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> okay. What did that do? Oh, that was hard to do. Eh, okay. I'm fully closed. Hi! Who's out there? Who wants to face me? In a battle to the death. I'm literally cornered right now. Baby? Baby? No, that's a lie. Yeah, I'm different. Hi. How are you? Oh my god. No? <laughs> oh god, it's not working! Ah! Ah! Oh god, oh god. Ah! I'm trying, guys, I'm trying! Hey, fucking fuck! Game over! <laughs> What was I supposed to do? I was trying. I was really trying. Oh God, that was horrifying. I had to fight for my life. Oh, I had to really pull on the son of a bitch. Oh geez, how? How can you do, oh, I'm under the desk again. Oh, fuck this. Oh, fuck, so like. Oh, okay. So, my problem was I was pulling away too far. What I needed to do was I needed to keep my, my, my little mouse hand on it and, like, keep it there. That was good, though. Oh, man. I like this. This is good. That was legitimately terrifying. It was so stress-inducing. Shut the fuck up! Oh! 
Hey! You still there? Hi. Okay. So you... Oh. No, you don't know that. You don't know. Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird. No, no, no. 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 Okay, I just got to click and hold on it. There we go. That's much better. So, like an idiot, I was under the desk just kind of like, oh, oh no. Oh, that's slipping away from me. I'm such a fool. And then they killed me and ate my brains. So what's interesting is the the voice on the intercom after the power shut down was not baby because I believe this is baby. Oh geez, come on! I'm pulling really hard. Ah! Oh geez, I'm pulling his. Okay, there we go. Th this is baby whispering to me because I remember from the trailer. He's watching us. Who's watching us? Okay. Bye. Who's watching you? Who's watching when you? When your guide comes back online, he is going to tell you that he was unsuccessful. That you must restart the system manually. He will then tell you to crawl through Ballora Gallery as fast as you can to reach the breaker room. If you follow his instructions, you will die. Oh. Ballora will not return to her stage anymore. She will catch you. Oh. The power will be restored shortly. When you crawl through Ballora Gallery, go slowly. She cannot see you, and can only listen for your movement. When you hear her music become louder, she is growing near, listening for you. Wait, and be still. Okay. Thank you for your patience. It seems that the power system cannot be restarted automatically. You will need to restart the power system manually. Please return to the primary control module. Okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go there. Okay, here we go. Going to the Ballora. Going to see Dancy Pants. We're gonna have a good old time. Dan Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. Dance it up a storm. Oh, jeez, this game. Okay. Let's do you this. will now be required to crawl through the Ballora Gallery using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. It is recommended that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. Mm. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. What? Deactivating. No! Okay, bye! Alright, so apparently if I go through this super fast, I'll die. Let's go through the super fast. Oh, why can't I see anything? It seems you are taking a long time. Please proceed as quickly and as quietly as possible. That is closer than I previously suspected you to be!
Malfunction you, trigger, breaker room. You may now interface with the breaker control box. <laughs> Using the interface may disrupt nearby electronics. <laughs> if you feel you are in danger, feel free to disconnect the interface temporarily until it is safe to reconnect. <laughs> Mascot response audio. Fuck, I thought I thought he got elevated. He did! He is elevated. He is. Okay. Jesus. I'm never gonna I, I just gotta hold it, right? Right? Okay. Required to crawl through the Ballora Gallery using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. Deactivating. Uh, okay. I think that's all for this episode. Um, I made a lot of progress, but this is really cool. Like, I can't deny it's different. It's definitely different, but it's got elements of a lot of different things here and I like what what's really interesting here is I haven't explored the entirety of the game yet there's still another section and apparently according to the map there's like 10 other sections out there and more vents to crawl through and like so many things to worry about this is legitimately amazing what has been accomplished here and I love it it's really good and my god I know ah jeez I didn't think it was Freddy that was going to get me ah I thought I didn't know who was talking there like, who the fuck was that? And who was the mascot? Was that little Bonnie on the puppet stand? There was- Oh, there's no one out here! I have no idea. But my god. This is amazing. So, I'm gonna get, uh, more videos of this out as soon as I can. Uh, but we made good progress here. It's just so... Fascinating. It's so fascinating what's going on here. I want to know so much more about it So we will find it out very soon. Thank you again everybody so much for watching Let me know what you think of this down in the comments below and as always I will see you in the next video Bye-bye